This is a commentary of Mega Man 11 for the Xbox One. And I feel like this episode was actually a pretty good episode to talk about. Because it was actually one of the episodes that's not a, re it's a recent console. Because the nerd only did up to PS3, which came out in the same year, 2013. And he only did a 2017 video. This was 2018. I went far and above. The nerd, the kid is not taking it back to the past. He taking it to the present as well. And the nerd just sticks up the 2000s, not the 2010s. I don't think this should have been a nerd episode. Because the nerd loves Mega Man and she keeps her playing the laughing game. But, I don't know if it's for James, but I think it'll be a James and Mike Monday episode rather than a kid episode. But, this episode is actually really cool. It's actually a really good way to start off the anger of the nerd. I actually loved doing angry videos, like angry rage games. I feel like doing Octodad for a while because Octodad's one of the most hardest games in the world. And this was another episode still filmed on the charger. And the game was so bright that I'll probably turn it into brightness and some because you couldn't see Mega Man because the the whole game was so bright you couldn't see him. But it's like whenever you get inside. Like whenever you get inside, like he goes crazy about it. Originally it's gonna be Billy as the second episode, like two bad games. But I realize maybe there's more to talk about with a rage game. And this was made on the same day. And this is me just raging going, get up there <laughs> Because I had to make one reference. And that was a reference to the Dark Green Duck episode, episode 135. And how was this video filmed? Well, basically, back then, I still had Mega Man as an angry game. And it still is a freaking hard game. I, and, I, and I said in the 12th episode, the newest one, that... You had to, like, yeah, you had to, like, duck, which I didn't know how to. Which is actually really true, because I did not know how to duck in Mega Man. Because I never played Mega Man, ever. Because I wasn't born as a bleep hands on the man. So, yeah, and this is where I decided to get really into it. So this part is actually where I actually get to see that the bug things go through the walls of the game. And which was really fun to film. Really fun to see. And the kid explains why they go through the wall. Look, see? It's like, why did they go through? <laughs> and look, and it's pretty funny. It's kind of like the... It was like the Goat Simulator episode. And I was also saying with those things, like. And it was pretty funny doing the boss fight because I. Like, whenever I was playing this, I thought I was on easy. But I realized I was on normal. Like, I played Magman, but I didn't. And this was my first Magman game I ever played. And it was the only Magman game I ever played. Even though Magman. Doesn't seem good to me for now, but I will get more into it after. And I'll still call it a good game series, but not to my opinion so far. I'll tell you what if I played it. And there's me defeating him. And you may wonder if I'm going to film these episodes a wee bit better. I will revisit the episodes I have on Chargers. I'll make them a wee bit better. Like this episode of Marble Madness, for example, because those episodes are only the charge episodes. The Burn Mars, Goofy Baby, Friends, and D the NES games were perfectly fine to me. Because those, like, had a wee bit more to talk about. Because they're just the only two episodes I had no time to do. Because this was back September 14th, so I was still doing school. 
And it's hard to just go and do kid episodes. Like on September 30th, I was off for the day. So I was lucky to be able to get a new kid episode out before I was gone. And I thought I had to delay it because of all the rushed episodes I had. And as we tried to run back through while the thing goes, but I realized I can't. And my favorite part of this video is really cool because, like, it's one of the episodes where why the angry kid is angry and why he has the word angry in his name. Because it's just me acting. I mean, if I did a different voice, it'd be the same. But James Rolfe, like, he's the nerd. He did, like, no voice. He did his own voice. And the part where you get hit by the stones is actually really freaking stupid. And there's me figuring out how to do stuff and saying the game is un un uncompletable. Like, I couldn't know how to get through there, and then I died. Then I go back, and then I yell, Fuuuuck. And then I just freaking throw the controller. <laughs> and what happened there was, I actually pushed the camera up. Which I forgot to like move because I felt like it would take it all day. And if I'd done that in the live episode, which could have been good, but I was too busy as acting as a kid, I didn't recognize it. And that's why the camera is always up. Which you can see my Mega Man a wee bit better, but. I don't qualify as a great, it was not a great episode, but it is good, because it's my own series, I made this like, a couple of days ago, I made this like, it's, it's been like a month since I made the kids series, and there's new episodes coming out really slow, but there won't be that many episodes, because, if I did so many episodes in here, it would just all be Halloween themed, but I feel like doing another Halloween episode, like, as episode, as episode 16, but I'm gonna wait till another Halloween to do that, that'll be in the hundreds, and there are three Halloween specials coming out in under the same month, which literally all the video is, and don't forget that I played Marvel Madness as my first game, and I didn't see in the video that it said from the arcade classic. And they explained this was in 1984. Yeah, a year before the game was released. And Mega Man 11 was the newest Mega Man game. <sighs> There's hair on my phone. And I am filming this on a phone. And the video is me saying how hard this game is. But then I did Cuphead, and then I did Mario. And I call Mario one of the hard, the rageous games the kids ever played. And it's not the rageous, but it is hard at some points. But Cuphead still earns it, and Mega Man is still trying to lead it. And it's probably, like, one of the great episodes of, like, to date. But I can't say anything else about it, because, like... <laughs> it's, there's me just going freaking crazy because the game's so hard. There's me flipping. There's me wearing a hat. <laughs> just, I had to think of what I could do as a rage. And I did everything I can. And I even have the Marble Madness game in my hand, throwing it and just flipping. And I feel like reviewing it bad. I feel like we brought Hannah on Xbox as episode 16 because that I haven't reviewed a bad game in a while. So I just can't find that many bad games I played. I mean, there are some on there, but there's not that many. Because this episode has so much stuff to do with it and it's pretty well. And there's something about this episode that gets me wondering. Was this bad? I mean, I'm trying to run away, but 
there's no other way you could get past the spikes. Like, is there a cheat? Is there, like, a way you could do it? And it's the first game I ever drink. I was like, how can, what can I drink that is not beer? Yeah, because, like, beer could get me drunk and I'm not old enough. So I said do coke because I haven't drunk that much because I don't get that many tins that are often. And the, nerd, and the kid doesn't get that angry. It's just me as an actor. As a freaking character. And I don't know why the Goofy Baby episode is popular. Just because any freaking Mickey episode is freaking popular. And there's something about this episode that really perplexes me. And there's other character choices. And I tried those out to see. Could those work out better? And I was wondering if the speed guy, the L one, I wonder if he could get past the spikes. And there I am. I fall down because I ran into the spikes. And that was probably one of the biggest mess ups I have ever done in 2019. I was meant to like do this, but I didn't want to play anymore. And like in my head, I didn't want to do it anymore because like, it was so frustrating. I couldn't take it. Like, seriously. And I fell down again. Because the anger was too much. And I felt like, I'm not playing anymore of this. But I had to finish the episode. Because I didn't have an actual copy of the game in my hands. Because I bought it as a demo. And it's like, one of, probably, a clever episode. Then I tried one more time, and then... I just try like one more time. I don't try, and I have nothing to say about this episode anymore because this episode was like really so like raging. Like I was literally freaking flipping, and I like go crazy, and it's just me, and that's it.